and here we go. Welcome again. Yeah, thank you very much, Patti. Now we are going to talk about something so beautiful, so nice. Today we are going to talk about love. But um, previous to that, I would like to ask you, what is your concept of love? Archimedes, what do you think about love? I believe it's a feeling. Um, imagine for me, Okay, yes. So, someone is talking. <laughs> yeah, Patty. Okay, Patty. Uh -huh. Yes, okay. I believe it's a feeling. Wonderful feeling. Uh -huh, excellent. Thank you very much, Patty. Archimedes, for you, what is love? Um, maybe like to say, Patty is a wonderful feeling to to someone or to something because I think that I I had love for in in my opinion and in personal opinion. Sometimes I I I love or I have love for my work. Excellent. I That's enjoy my work. Aha, uh -huh, that's wonderful. That's beautiful. Okay, thank you, Archimedes. Ale, Alejandra, are you there? Can you listen to me? Um, maybe she continues having problems with her microphone. Uh, Jose Manuel, can you speak now? Mm, I guess no. Hello? Yes? It's me, uh, Alejandra. Excellent, Ale. Tell me, for you, what is love? Uh, for me, is uh, be happy, is to live, and have uh, to have a purpose. Hey, that's beautiful. Yes, that was very nice. Thank you very much, Ale. So, Thank you. Okay. Juan, please talk to us about uh, what is your concept of love for you? What is love? Juan, hello. Maybe Juan is hello, hello. Teacher, teacher. Yes, yes, we listen to you. Yes, I, I I have a problem with my microphone. Yes. Don't worry. In, okay. In my opinion, the love is the force to live better. Wow, beautiful! You know what? Yes. That's a wonderful concept. Yes. Okay. Thank you very much, Mirel. Okay. Thank you. Mirel, please talk to us about your concept of love. Mm, I think it's giving everything of us, expect to be received. Wow, hey, that's beautiful. Excellent. Thank you very much. Okay, so who's missing? Jose Manuel. Jose Manuel, if you can't speak, why don't you write in the, in the chat so that we can see what you think, all right? Look at this. Here we have 10 ways to say I love you. Archimedes, could you read the first, please? The first one. Here. Sorry. Sorry. Yes, uh, yes uh, I am crazy about you. All right. Thank you very much. Okay. Uh, Archimedes, who's your victim? Uh, Mirel. All right, thank you. Mirel, could you? <clears throat> yes, um, you complete me. Thank you. Mirel, who's your victim? Uh, Alejandra, please. Okay, thank you. Thank you. 
Uh, the next I'm head over head for you. Excellent, thank you very much. Okay, Ale, who's your victim? Is Juan Bravo. Thank you. I, I adore you so much. Excellent, thank you. Juan, who's your victim? I can see the next. Ah, uh, here we have to Blanca Patti, to Mirel. Patti, please. Okay, Patti. Okay, you're special to me. Thank you, Patti. Uh, who's your victim? <laughs> Mirel. All right, thank you. I can live without you. Thank you, Mirel. Who's your victim? Eh, Juan Bravo, Arquímedes, perdón. Ok, Arquímedes. Ok, you are the light of my life. Wow, thank you, all right. Arquímedes, who's your victim? Eh, Juan Bravo. Thank you. Yes, you mean the world to me. Excellent, thank you. Juan, your victim? Mm. <laughs> I, I can see the names. Ah, here we have two, Alejandra, Blanca Patti, Mirel. Mirel, please. All right, thank you. You're everything to me. Excellent, thank you, Mirel. Mirel, who's your victim? Blanca Patti, por favor. Thank you. Okay, yes. you're the love of my life. Excellent. All right, look at this. Now uh, we are going to write in the chat what is our favorite phrase of all of the, the ones that we can see in, on the screen. I'm crazy about you, you complete me, I'm head over heels for you, etc. And we are going to write if we would dedicate it to anyone else. I am going to write an example. Uh, my favorite phrase is um, head uh, over heels for you. Uh, I dedicate it to my cat. Why? To my cat. <laughs> no, not to my cat. To my children. The children, yes. Aha, uh -huh, children. Aha, uh -huh. here it is. Okay, so can you write in your in the chat who what is your favorite phrase and who you dedicate it to? Oh, Blanca, very good. My children are the love of my life. Wonderful. That's beautiful. I adore my mother so much. Wow, beautiful. Archimedes. My favorite phrase, phrase, remember, is with PH, is you complete me. I dedicate it to my wife. Oh, so beautiful. Mirel. My favorite phrase is, you're the love of my life, and I dedicate it to the man who I love. Wow, so beautiful. Wonderful. Okay, Alejandra wrote, my favorite phrase is, you're special to me. I dedicate it to my daughter and my husband. Oh, so nice, so beautiful. Juan, my favorite phrase is, I'm crazy about you. I dedicate it to my woman, Sonia. Oh, so beautiful. Thank you very much. All right, who's missing? Jose Manuel. Okay. You know what? Now we are going to see another image. 
Uh, uh, let me move this thing. All right. Look at this. Here we have some very nice and interesting phrases. Uh, we are going to read some of them. So let me erase all the little hearts I, 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 I posted. Okay, here we are. So please, uh, could you, uh, Ale, Alejandra, could you help us reading the first one? Yes, yes, yes. Uh, the real power of a man is in the size of the smile on the woman sitting there next to him. Thank you very much. So, Ale, what's your opinion about this phrase? Is in my my opinion is the is is beautiful. Wow! Yes, that's great. I like it so much. All right, Blanca Patti, please. Okay, I believe that the phrase means that behind a man there is a woman. It's like I, I say in Spanish. Excellent. Yes, you're right. I agree with you. Okay, any volunteers? Anybody who would like to, to say your opinion? Sure. Yes, please, Juan. I am agree with this phrase because my wife is it has a wonderful smile. Oh, that's beautiful. Yes, Excellent. Beautiful. <laughs> that's great. Thank you, okay. Juan. All right. So, any other volunteer? Mm, me, Maggie. I think that this phrase is very very real because uh, the woman in this case my wife gave me her power when her smile oh that's wonderful excellent thank you all right so any other any volunteer come on don't be shy <laughs> all right Okay, Blanca. Okay, the next. I like that a flower worn over the left ear in Hawaii signifies that a woman is no longer single. Oh, that's nice. Patty, thank you. Uh, did you know that, that in Hawaii it, uh, it goes like that? But guess what? In Mexico, we have also... Uh, some communities where women wear some flowers on the left ear also so that they show that they are single. Do you know where? Have you seen where? No, anyone? No. Perhaps in Oaxaca? Aha, uh -huh, in Oaxaca there is a place, uh, I guess it is in San Nicolás. And there is also the, that custom in Guerrero, in, the, in La Costa Chica. So yes, it's, it's so beautiful, it's so colorful, and it's so traditional. And do you know any custom like, well, not exactly the same, but similar in Mexico? I don't know. No? No. Anybody? Uh, may I say that in Veracruz? Aha. Yes, Miguel says yes, Veracruz. Miguel, why don't you talk to us about that use? I'm sorry, I, I don't understand. Uh, I... Could you could you talk to us about the the flowers in Veracruz? Yes, I I know sure. I I think that maybe. That can be because I was see some woman woman using a flower in in the in the ear, 
I think because they, uh, in, in the way, <laughs> they are no more single. But I'm not sure. Uh, you know what? Long time ago, I used to dance in a folk ballet. And I remember that when we were uh, making up and putting all the ornaments in our heads, uh, the teacher once said, if you are going to dance the Guerrero dance or Veracruz and even Tabasco, if you are single, you have to wear the flower in the left ear so if you put it in the right ear people is going to know that you are married and i said wow <laughs> that's nice mm -hmm. you know what i have also heard that in jalisco there is in guadalajara there is a park where women single women uh, stand up and walk in circles so that men could see them so if there is a man who liked a woman, he is going to walk next to him. If she likes the man, then they are going to continue walking. And later on, they are going to be apart so that they can talk. But if the man who walks next to the woman is not so attractive for her, then she is going to continue walking and she is not going to accept to go any other place to talk. So I don't know if you have heard something like that. Yes. Yes, that's beautiful, isn't it? Thank you. And it's so nice. It's very interesting. Yes, it is. They are very beautiful customs in Mexico. Okay, so Archimedes, where are you from? I am from uh, uh, a city of the Puebla State, and near to Veracruz State. Wow, beautiful! I remember, I remember so uh, in a in a city, a uh, Tlapacoyan city. It's a city of Veracruz State, uh, uh, on the Sunday and the uh, between afternoon and uh, between the night. The the people walk around the park and walk uh, a lot of a single woman. Mm -hmm. So they were going to look for a boyfriend. And and I I in 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 a lot time ago I don't understand because why they walk around the the park. Wow. <laughs> Maybe that is the reason. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's so romantic, so nice. Thank you very much, Archimedes. So, anybody else? Eh, Mirel, you are from Veracruz. You talked to us about the flowers. Is there any other use like that in Veracruz? Any no, other I'm, custom? I'm from Cancun, but in, some uh. in, in a time I, I was see that in Veracruz. Ah, yeah, all right. So. Uh, in Cancun, is there any custom like that? Mm, no, here usually they made like how you say ofrenda? Offer. Offer uh -huh, to to the god Iche, that the woman be uh, blessed with the love and with the um, with the opportunity to have child. Wow. Hey, that's beautiful. Thank you very much. That's beautiful and interesting. Yeah. Okay. Um, who else? Juan, where are you from? I come from of uh, Quito, Quito, Ecuador. Excellent. And is there any custom like this? Yes, it's similar, but I can. I have other. Uh, history in the Amazons of tri uh, tribes. For example, when the young need, uh, uh, need, how do you say, conseguir? Get. Yes, get uh, a woman. Uh, it offered uh, a, a pork or cow 
for the fathers of the of the future woman. Ah, oh, wow. The fathers is agree, no problem. The marriage is in one or two months. Uh, oh. the, the marriage is is a, a great uh, party uh, with uh, uh, chicha. Chicha is a name. It's a traditional uh, uh, drink. Drink, yes. It's made of corn with uh, sugar. Wow. Yes. In the the next day, <laughs> the the couple are uh, are resting. <laughs> Near, near the the river or the forest or the forest. Wow, <laughs> that is very good. <laughs> yes. Thank you very much for sharing. That's so interesting. Okay, teacher. Okay, so uh, Ale, where are you from? I'm from Mexico City. Excellent. Thank you. And do you know any custom like that in in your community? For example, in Coyoacán or in, I don't know, in Alameda, in Mexico City. Uh, I don't know. Uh, I don't know. Uh, no, I don't know. Uh, I wouldn't any. Custom. No, any. any custom? No. Uh, yeah, you know what? In big cities, it's more difficult that people observe some of those traditions. I don't know, I think that big cities are a little colder. Well, it, from my point of view, but yes, you, you're right. It is not very common to see those kind of customs like rituals. All right, thank you very much. Uh, Blanca Pati, where are you from? And it's the people is called, mm -hmm. as you said. Yes, you're, it, it, well, it is okay. It's a way of, of living. It's something that that we we have to admit sometimes. Okay, Blanca Pati wrote, also in the state of Mexico in Tenango del Valle. I remind that in Chiapas or Oaxaca, people give handkerchief to the loved woman. Oh, that's beautiful. Those are very nice, so nice customs. All right, you know what? Here we have a fact. Cuddling triggers a reaction in the brain similar to taking painkillers. Did you know that? Cuddling, what does cuddling mean? Cuddling means when you hug somebody to make him or her sleep, something like arrullar, and trigger means cause. So when you cuddle somebody, you have a reaction in your, in your brain, similar to taking, I don't know, ibuprofeno, paracetamol, mm -hmm. eh, naproxeno. Did you know that? What's your opinion? Uh, Ale, what's your opinion about that? Do you think that it is true? Yes, it's true. Uh, with my Ivan uh, Tigers, it's, on, it's a, the, what do you say? Te hace ser más. It makes you? It makes you? Yes, I, I de, uh, have be happy. Ah, it makes you be happy. Yes. Hey, that's great. Thank you very much. So, Ale, who's your victim? Hmm. Is uh, Jose Manuel. Thank you. Um, I guess that Jose Manuel continue having problems with his uh, microphone. Oh, uh, he's Mirel. Thank you. Mm, about the phrase, I think, uh, I believe in that because uh, the love is uh, um, 
something that we can cover all the pains, but we can have in, in our heart. Mm, I don't know. I, I think this is amazing. And of course, I believe that. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, Mire, who's your victim? Uh, Alejandra. Mm, Alejandra has already spoken. Ah, okay. Uh, Archimedes. All right. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, in my opinion, um, yes, is uh, I think it's true because uh, the uh, the message, uh, the people or the knowledge said uh, these uh, feelings. Uh, how do you say liberal? Is the delivers delivers some uh, kind of substances in the in the in the brain. How uh, the brain can de deliver s some kind of substances to feel so good. Excellent. Yes, you're right. You know what? Even I was going to talk to you about this one. Look, love makes our uh, brain... No, love lowers our serotonin levels, which makes us crazy. So yes, when when we fell in love, or when we are with the person we love, our brain begins to work in a different way. It's so unexpected, and so it makes us to uh, deliver some different substances. So uh, yes, I think that, uh, for example, we when we cuddle somebody, we deliver uh, serotonin. No, uh, oxytocin, dopamine, so it makes us feel completely fine. Uh, and so it helps to our health also. Okay, thank you. Um, yes. This is the reason that the people uh, if that falling in love don't see the real the real thing of the their their their, their partner. Aha, uh -huh, yes, that's it. Love is something like a drug. Yes. Aha, uh -huh. <laughs> okay. Thank you very much, Archimedes. Who's your victim? Uh, maybe my victim will be Juan Bravo. Right, thank you. Oof. I am agree with the other uh, participation. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> very easy. Okay. Anybody else? A volunteer. Hello. Mm, you know what? I would like to share this uh, these surprising facts about love. Here they say that guys are more likely to say I love you first. I don't know if it is true. Men, what do you think? Archimedes, Juan, what do you think? Is it true that men are more likely to say, I love you first? No. To, uh, to me, no. Uh, yes. Uh, and what do, what do you think about it, Juan? In my case, I, I need first uh, to know my, my couple, and I love uh, after. Aha, uh -huh, okay, excellent. So, Gertz, what do you think about it? Ali, what's your opinion? Is a, well, Patty, Patty said, we men says I love you very fast. Yeah, you're right. I agree with you. Okay, so anybody else's, a volunteer, anybody else's opinion? No? All right. So look at this. I would like to share with you this one. Love can be addictive, literally. Wow, that's beautiful. What's your opinion? Oh, I agree with this topic. Ah, yes, it could be. Richard? 
Yes. In my case, I am agreeing because I have a, a 35 years in, in my marriage. Oh, hey, that's <laughs> beautiful. Congratulations to you. Thank you. I am very happy. I, 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 I am a very good family. Wow. Hey, that's beautiful. Congratulations to you. Thank you the love is can be healthy for me yeah uh, love is a blessing you are blessed yes excellent anybody else's opinion oh don't be shy okay you know what uh, there are many things to say about love because love is the force that makes us work, it is our motor. I think that it is not only good, it is not only beautiful, but also necessary for all people. We can have love for our couple, our husband or wife. We can feel love for our family, for love, uh, for life, for God, for our work. So love is uh, immense, it's massive. It's necessary. It's necessary, yes, that's it. Not only to be happy, but also to be healthy. When we are in love, we are healthy most of the time. Okay, well, I think that we could say a lot more, but guess what? Unfortunately, time is over, but uh, we are going to continue talking next class. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Okay, teacher. Thank you, teacher. Thank you. Have a very good night. Thank, Thank you. you. Good night. Good night. good night, everyone. See you next. See week. you, everyone. Bye. Meet you next. Thank you, teacher. Thanks to you. Thank you.